Welcome back guys to Paper Mario Color Splash, where after taking a round trip tour of the island, I restored my HP back in the boat after saving. With all the enemies having respawned, we're looking to avoid them by taking, of course, the next round trip. In our weirdly toned under parallel universe. But we have opened the way, including with codes and traps, if I'm right in saying. Let's crumple you, sorry, I want these. Because being able to get some more cars would be good. However, it seems we are capped out currently. Not too bad, apart from one of them's a really big go. Oh, let's just leave it. We're fine. If we've got cards, we've got cards. We can fight through with what we have. So, there's probably another card there after all. Let's crumple you. Because now we've opened this, this bridge, we can get across no problem. Apart from the problem. In fact, it's probably best for me to just take it out as fast as possible. As he falls down with a 10 stack boo, do you? Right, well the best thing for you is probably gonna be something along these combinations. For a 10 stacker she'll be taken out. Especially if I get my excellence. Problem is, can I take this guy on two jumps? Even with the excellent the end, we couldn't. He's got a fair bit of cap left. And that's 18 damage block. Well, better use one of my buddies, I think. Go, Koopa. Go get him. Though, if you're going to spin, you're probably going to fall off the ledge at the other side. In fact, he did, actually, and never returned. Come on, easy defeat. That's fine by me. A couple of cars used means I can just come back over to here. Take another ice flat. And to be honest, if my foes are using ice, I don't really need to get anything good for that, am I? You can hammer there. And where we're really headed is over here. Because, of course, what do we want to do? We want to put a cork in a poisonous volcano. So you're just going to move back and forth, are you? Now, I was about to say, isn't this room full of traps? Ow! No wonder, he's literally tracing the lines as well, in a way that's showing us. Just wondering if there's any way to see these things. Doesn't seem it. So I should have remembered this, not just try to remember the code. Oh no, there's a line there. Well, I think the last one was, yeah, there's a line here. Can you see it? And a line there. Okay, cool. Well, the code, which I look back on in the video, just because it was obvious I'd need it if I was going along again. I think is this. Because it was too obvious with its formations. that is what I'd be doing. Especially when it hides the spikes on the other side as well. It made it a little bit blatant. A worn out hammer times three. Anything over here that I missed in terms of painterizing, though to be honest there's enough problems as is. Obvious code is obvious. A triple jump is actually probably a card I would like. So is there a card I would not like on my list currently? Let's just get rid of just a random card so I can pick that up because that's a lot of damage on that card. Alright, there were no other traps or codes, I don't think. It's just this door. Mario, I smell something delicious coming from inside that cave. I'm gonna go take a closer look. What again? But you say it smelled delicious this time. It's just like a smoky room in the normal world. I can see something in there, but unless we do something about that smoke, we won't be able to get it. Yeah, yeah, we know where we're going. 
Because once the water's drained on this side, we're fine to get through. However, I bet there is enemies in here instead of treasure chests this time. No? I'm fine with there being nothing more than just a painty spot. Sorry, Devil Hammer, you'll have to be left behind. We know where it is, we must go. Hey, look at that! It's a barbecue. Someone over there is making all of that smoke. Who is that? Well, in this world, they are. I think it's the legendary pirate. In the meantime, though, these booze are going to get my way. Ahoy! Why are you drawn here by this oh so delicious aroma? Well, keep your boots on. It'll be ready in a minute. Why, thank you. My boots are well strapped. I think I'll take your barbecue, thank you. I don't know what I'll need it for, but there we go. It has been rung dry. Charcoal Grill. Grills food to perfection. Too many cards, drop one. Oh, that's just rude. Well, at least it warns you. It doesn't just say, oh, you can't have it. How dare you ring out my grill? I was almost really rare too! He's not messed up now, boy. There's no fury like Hungry Captain Fury! I'm gonna follow you around all passive-aggressively until you're mildly annoyed. Look, we're sorry about your food. It's just that squeezing things usually helps us in our adventure. It's, it's a reflex at this point. Plus, I mean, it smelled really good. He's gonna follow me around all passively-aggressively. I've been sitting there savoring that sweet smoky scent for hours and you had to go and ruin it! So I'm gonna stick to you like a bad rash until you make it up to me somehow. Sure, I guess. Let's just dodge boo number one and boo number two. That's passive aggressive toad, captain. Follows us around. This toad is really persistent. Don't think we're gonna be able to lose him. There's no fury like Hungry Captain Fury, you know, get boy. Oh, I'm fine. I'm technically actually quite fine with this. It's okay. It's not like you're doing anything bad. Until you do something bad. Please don't do something bad. Well, I'm going all the way back round again. The obvious thing here is to take another loop. Just due to... What's in that room now? The smoke's been removed. Now let's just go into all the spike pits again as well. Because, you know, I want to do that. Yeah, it was this side again, and then it's this side, and then it's through the middle. Yes! Remembrance! And in we go. Treasure! Oh, salt and pepper shakers as well! No more smoke! I think I'll take the salt and pepper shakers then. He'll probably be annoyed at me just randomly squeezing another thing in front of him. They're very, very fancy ones. Seasons even the blandest of meals. Too many cards, drop one yet again. Uh. Right, you okay with that? Seems you're fine. That's fine by me. You just don't get angry there. Oh, what's up there? It's just a fire over there? Well, we know that there's obviously something here. Do you want the one coin? No, you don't want the treasure? Okay. Well, now we got to find out what's on the other side. Well, one more treasure is ours. Passively aggressively follow me, Toad. It's time to take you to another world, I think. A salt and pepper shaker is all ours. Obviously the most important thing on our adventure thus far. But now when we have our rations, we will have them good. You coming? I somehow don't think you belong in this world, to be honest. And this one, maybe. Is that another toad over there? It's been so long since I've seen another toad, I almost forgot what we look like. Oi, Toad, come over here. I don't have any barbecue to offer you on account of this plumber guy here, but... The yellow spots, the yellow vest, the oversized pirate hat, the jumbo cutlass. You're the... You're the... 
He lost his fighter voice for a second. You're a legendary captain! Just too shocked to put it on anymore. Let me get this straight. You lost your memory. You can't remember nothing at all. That's right, bub. I have absolutely no idea why I'm here on this other island. By the way, I really like your garb, but it looks a little familiar. Are you copying me, mate? Well, uh, we still got that big paint star to find, so you two take all the time you need. Hope your memory's come back. Yes, you, you do the talking. Oh, let's find out. Me and another toad after such a long time is a breath of fresh air. So while I haven't forgotten about the girl incident, I'll let it go for now. Okay. Aye, I'll look for the captain's journal to see if I can jog his memory. You and Yui go find that pink star. Ah, I will. Pirate reunion, though, to be honest, it's not reunion if they haven't met. That's not the point. So we're full on cards. Hello, ladder guys. So I guess that's what he meant. And now we got Fiery Man here. Not to be so rude and chuck stuff at me. At least we can see the pits this time. No making a mistake now, eh? My about an HP boat full worth of HP. Oh, there's the save block. I could use that. Uh. Uh. Maybe it didn't appear there until afterwards. That's also a theory. And we got that block to fall down in the parallel world, but we're here. It's a big pain star. All right, the smoke is gone. Let's wake up the big paint star. Uh, what was that? Wendy is what that was. Oh, well, if it isn't the man of the hour, you're late. I've been waiting for you forever, mister. I was beginning to think you stood me up. I thought to myself, Wendy, is Mario ever going to show up? And then I dozed off. Anyway, Mr. Bowser sent me to stop you from getting your grubby little mitts on this big paint star. And now that I've gotten some peace for rest, it's time to help you rest in peace. Now, since you did come all the way to Fortune Island, I guess you must really like money, honey. Tee hee, get ready for payday. What do you want to do? What were we doing? Are we just going to beat each other up? No extra gimmicks? No nothing? Go charcoal grill if you want to get on that. Scratch that. I was gonna no, let's use it. I've got two. I'm worrying that she might do some kind of special dodger majigging. Do I go all out straight away or not? These are the questions. And do I wear something defensive? You know what? I haven't wore this yet, so let's do it. Doesn't have, seem to have any secret way out, but the damage on her isn't so much. We've barely got her shoes unpainted. No, she seems quite fine with all that. So what we'll do is we'll put on a frog suit. There's money, honey. Okay, it's all based on musical tones. Well, that hurt quite a bit. And I guess it's not going to help at all. If that's the case, maybe we'll try spikes. Maybe that'll be defensive enough. I don't know. And we could go all out with something big and brutal. Because we've got a fair few of them on the island. This is a big use of paint. Maybe we can deflect the coins like that. Now that seemed to do a little bit more damage, didn't it? Well, I guess that's what you get when you actually use some paint like that. We're up to our lifts. 
We've got gold shy guys in here. That looks like he could die. How very painful. And the one we didn't get, he's in on the battle now. All those coins, you're not even smiling. Well, I'll smile big enough for the both of us. Take my picture, honey! Now get ready for something more valuable than coins. Let's see one last big smile before I end this. Say cheese! She's telling me to use something very specifically because I'm guessing she loves having her picture taken. And that will get her out of her shell. It looks like she has a barrier to stop you attacking her sideways. And of course you can't jump on her because she's got spikes. That pretty much roughly tells us what we're doing, yeah? Before we do anything though, by the way. It's a big mushroom to heal. Then let's find the camera in our scale here. And hope I've got enough paint for it. And then we need something attacking after that. I have enough paint. Let's use the theory. If she keeps mentioning cameras, you gotta think it's gonna be. Also the other hints. So I got an excellent there on Mario. By pressing A at the right time. First time I really actually tried. Now what's going on? Oh, it's a defensive shield? Here it comes, Wendy's gorgeous golden ring. Protect your neck. My golden ring has you in its embrace. Your face is priceless. Except that it's got my picture. So I didn't take your picture to get you out. I took mine. Now the problem is, is we can't use the... What I should have used is the one-up shroom on that one. Because it had been ready to go. I don't have any other big attacks, I don't think. could try to use this, just because it's coloured, and see if that works out for us. Yeah, I don't have many coloured cards, let's put it that way. I imagine I can use that though. Let's try to use this as a combo. She's out after all, and she's getting low on HP. Does replica balloons actually do much damage? There's another diva on the show here. It's gonna show you up. Or did it charm her or something, or attempt to? No balloons, and now we've got the paint to finish us off. That's all I really needed. I'm tired of looking at your face, so how about I break it? Sounds good. Fine, my photo just took everything for me. What? Why can't I beat you? Because you're fighting a photo, you noob. That's all the thing I can say. If you can't tell the difference, then you kind of deserve to get beaten like this. Two big flowers. So let's queue up some other stuff. I think I should probably aim to defeat her in this turn. In case she's going to use her ring again, I do not have another camera. No, we just turned it to ashes. Very nice of us. Oh fine, you beat me, I get it! I can't believe I came all the way out to this stupid island waiting on this cramped shelf for days on end, only to lose! Well, at least I lost you. Don't tell Mr. Bowser I said this, but you're kind of cute, Mario. Tee hee! And off you go. 
We did it! Now we can take out that big paint star! We can take that big paint star! We got what we came for, but the captain must be wholly depressed about the lack of treasure here. Yes, about that. I discovered long ago, the treasure of Fortune Island has already been claimed! It's the captain. Does that mean you remember what happened, um, other captain? Yeah, I remember everything. I crossed the Lost Sea and the Violet Isles. I came alone to this island. Sure, I opened up a few treasure chests here and there, but most of them were empty. Yar, so there was treasure on this island, which means we'd be too late to be scavenging it. Aye, but the only real treasure in my view was that lovely grill. I caught me noggin pretty bad while exploring that funny parallel world, totally knocked myself out. And when I came to, I was there in a the parallel world just frying up some fish. Anyway, the fish was pretty good. Nothing like a little amnesia to work up the old appetite, let me tell ya. Arr. So the treasure of Fortune Island be no more. I was too late. All those years of searching. Don't it down the mouth now. The sea is wide, the world is wide. There are incredible undiscovered treasures are waiting to be plundered. Go get your hands salty in the sea, mate. You'll make a fine legend yet. Come, I'll show ya. Blimey, you'll teach me your legendary ways. I'll be the best treasure of all. Yaha! Oh, now let's wake up our treasure. The big pink star. No, not until I've done that. Not until I've checked in here. Yeah, I want my one coins, don't you know? All treasures must contain only one coin. That's how it works. Big pink star! Wake up. We got the big paint star leading us back to, of course, the port. Ask me to join you next episode. Bye-bye.